Welcome to the nag's head. Only kidding. This is the flying pelican. No, what is it? The elusive pelican. The elusive pelican. So elusive, can't you remember its name? This is our lovely bar. Uh, it would be working now, but none of the drinks are here. Stage management haven't set them yet. So I don't really know what I'm going to do. Very unusual to be behind a bar when there's no drinks. There's some lovely food in here. Soda stream and... <gasps> This is Monty, our lovely, reliable pooch. Plays a big part in Three Men in a Boat, as I'm sure some of you who have read the book will know. He's, uh, he's a lovely dog, and he accompanies us on our journeys, on, on our, all of our misadventures up and down the Thames. Shall we go and have a little look round? As you can see, we are in a lovely English pub. The reason for setting Three Men in a boat in a pub is because uh, we wanted to do something that was quintessentially English and what better thing for that than to be down the local. Uh, as you can see there are oars above the fireplace, again boating theme, and there's lots of other bric-a-brac, all of which gets used, or most of it does during the, the course of the show. And uh, really if you're telling a story, a kind of old English pub is probably the best place to be because that's where stories get told anyway. And obviously the set helps that as well. a boating adventure told by um, Jay, who is Jerome K. Jerome, and his adventures kind of going up the Thames with his two chums, uh, Harris and George, and the adventures they kind of <laughs> experience along the way. And uh, it kind of um, spawned the birth of, you know, what we know as English comedy, things from the Pythons going straight through till modern day, kind of very much uh, English people being silly. But we've also updated it slightly as well, because uh, the um, the comedy is so universal. We've, there are a couple more maybe modern references in there and uh, we've tried bringing it as much up to the modern day as we can but whilst remaining true to uh, Jerome's original uh, novel. So come and see us, come and see Monty and he says he's fantastic. I won't go that far. Oh. <laughs> oh you devil Monty. Good joke, good joke. Oh, um, I, I can't tell you unless you come and see the show. Otherwise, you won't really understand it. Yeah, I know, I know. Calm down, calm down. <laughs>